I'm Vincent Leroy, I'm assistant professor here at Central Nantes and at the Lea Research Department. I first was a student here in engineering at Central Nantes and during my studies I notably had the opportunity of doing a gap year that I split between um, um, six months in a research department at university in the UK and then also um, six or eight months in, um, in a firm working in renewable energy systems. Uh, my last year of engineering was then spent uh, studying on hydrodynamics and ocean engineering. After uh, I had my degree, I started a PhD here at Central Nantes on the numerical simulations of offshore floating wind turbines. And then after this, I did a postdoc uh, that was in collaboration uh, between the Institute of Marine Technology of NTNU in Trondheim in Norway and Central Nantes. And so I had the opportunity of working there for one year before coming back uh, in Nantes. And then a position opened uh, as assistant professor in experimental hydrodynamics in Central Nantes. Um, well, when I finished my postdoc, I was actually more concentrating on experimental hydrodynamics. Uh, coming from the world of numerical simulation, it's actually very fulfilling to be using these skills in numerical simulations applied to experimental modeling. And the opportunity of working in Central Nantes was also very exciting uh, because we have not only these very exciting facilities and exceptional facilities uh, of, um, of our test tanks and uh, also the expertise of the whole team there on one hand uh, on the experimental modeling but also then in the numerical simulation also makes then a very um, complete and ex expert team to work with. So I'm working on the modeling of floating offshore wind turbines and mostly experimental modeling. Um, these systems are very complex systems at sea. They are very, very large, gigantic. Um, we, well, they can reach over um, several hundred uh, meters height. So these systems can deform and interact very strongly with the wind and the waves. And so I'm focusing mostly on the, wind, on the wave structure interaction, also including the effect of the wind. In order to do this, I then work with the whole team there uh, at, uh, at the LEA um, in the wave tank, so on experimental modeling. And then we also try to develop new innovative strategies to model these systems in the wave tank. two main scales. Uh, the first one is at the scale of the lab. Uh, it's very uh, enlightening here to be working with such infrastructure. Uh, so experimental infrastructure such as the wave tanks but also the offshore test site that we have in Le Croisic called Samrev, uh, in which we have also a team of experts that is working there on uh, notably floating wind. Then we also have uh, the expertise of the, team of the teams working on numerical simulation that also um, provides a lot of uh, very interesting insight in our research. And this also helps us gaining some visibility, of course, um, on a wider scale. And at the scale of the school, it's also very interesting to be working in a multidisciplinary environment with other laboratories that are working, for example, on structural mechanics or on control. Uh, this is very exciting and fulfilling in a field such as the modeling of floating offshore wind turbines. So I work with other colleagues, uh, researchers here at the LEA Research Department, uh, from uh, the INE team in numerical simulation and experimental modeling uh, of offshore systems, and also with researchers from the team SEMREV that works on the offshore test site in Le Croisic. And we're also very, very lucky to have in the laboratory a team of technicians and engineers uh, whose support is invaluable in our research projects. Well, there are many projects uh, underway. Um, basically, the, the, the main idea behind it is to continue working on the improvement of the experimental modeling uh, of these systems, also numerical modeling, in order to uh, improve our ability to model them, improve also their design, and then eventually to improve the design method that we have and uh, the theories that are behind it. It is also very exciting uh, to have the opportunity to transfer knowledge into teaching. Uh, for example, in uh, the specialization Ocean, in which I was a student about 10 years ago, or in the new specialization that is opening next September in the renewable energy sector.